Solving a word problem that gives us a system of linear equations. So what we have here is pretty much the exact same as any other word problem, where our main challenge is to create equations that we can deal with. In this particular example, well, we're going to end up with two equations, so we're going to have a system to solve. So our situation is that a boat travels 24 miles in three hours with the current, and then against the same current, it can travel 16 miles in four hours. <clears throat> Sorry. And what we're supposed to do is find the rate of the boat and the current in still water. Okay, so the main things I want to take with me are 24 miles in three hours with the current, 16 miles in four hours against the current. Okay, and like most distance rate time problems, the easiest way to deal with sorting out your data is to make a chart. Okay, so let's go do that. So what we have is we are going 24 miles with the current and 16 miles against. Our time is 3 and our time is 4. Okay. And then what we have left is our boat speed and our current speed. So when we are traveling with the current, the speeds work together. Okay? So what we can end up with is boat plus current. And I'm a big fan of just using letters that actually sort of make sense in the problem. So B is going to be boat speed, C is going to be current speed. Against it, the current is slowing the boat down. So what we end up with is B minus C. Okay. So what we have then is a system, an equation we can make for with our speed and an equation we can make for against, our, against the current. Um, putting these together, distance is equal to rate times time. So for this equation, what we end up with is distance is equal to rate, which is B plus C, times time. And we have another equation for against. 16 is equal to 4 B minus C. Okay, so to make my life a little bit easier, what I see is both of these equations can be divided by a, a number to make our numbers a little bit smaller. Okay, so our top equation we can divide by 3, our bottom equation we can divide by 4. So dividing that out, what we end up with is 8 is equal to B plus C, and 16, we, sorry, divide by 4 is 4 is equal to B minus C. Now we just have a system. We can solve this out as we would any other system. We could either do elimination or substitution. What I see is right here, if I add these equations together, my C's are going to disappear. So add, end up with 12 is equal to 2B. Our C's canceled. So what that tells us is we divide by 2. 6 mile per hour is equal to the boat speed. Just like any system, when we find one answer, we plug it back in to find the other. Six, we could plug it into any of these equations. These are actually the same exact thing because all we did was divide by constant. So what we find here is four is equal to six minus two. Our current speed has to be, sorry, four is equal to six minus C. I solved that step in my head. What we find is two miles per hour is equal to the current. So oh, by taking our word problem, making a table, we were able then to set up a system of equations, which we solve just as we would any other system.